Hey guys, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. It has been a minute. It has been a long minute and a lot of my uploads up until now have obviously been either parkour or stunt driven. And I wanted to give you guys an update what I've been up to in the last few years, where I am now and what I'm going to be moving towards more of and the sort of uploads and content that I'm going to be driving more towards my channel moving forwards. So firstly, without further ado, what have I been up to? So a lot has happened, a lot has happened. I've actually moved out to Los Angeles where I now live with my girlfriend and my little puppy. I've transitioned a lot, so parkour is still a huge part of my life. I'm still involved in 3Run, I'm involved in WFPF out here, and I'm still doing a lot of stunt work, although I've also been transitioning a little bit more into coordinating, choreographing, and just pulling uh, gigs together and working with different people out here. So what does that look like on a day-to-day? -day? Well, I do a lot of really kind of management side of things now where I'm pulling in different gigs for different performers and helping other people get jobs and performances, collaborations, whatever it might be. And I'm spending a lot of time, unfortunately, on the laptop just doing emails and things like that. There's still a few gigs that I'm doing as a performer, which I'm fortunate enough to do, and I want to continue doing a lot of that. But I'm also now spending a lot more time on the production side where I've also been producing a lot of content. So for example, with my producing side of things and the management side of things, I've got a company with a business partner of mine called 1DS, and we specialize in producing, I think, dope ass content. <laughs> in managing really cool talent and really cool people and taking everything that I've learned as a performer from three run stunts and all the rest of it and building other people's careers and brands as part of the journey for the career that they want to do as performers or athletes or influencers or whatever that might be. Now what that means for me, unfortunately, I don't get to train as much as I used to. I still train and I still get to go down to jam a lot of the time. Um, I still go down to Santa Monica and swing around and just trying to stay fit as best I can. A lot of that more recently I'm just trying to get back into. There was definitely a period, I'd say a good year, where I wasn't able to train as much as I wanted to or just didn't have the same drive, to be perfectly honest, to try and maintain the kind of level that I used to be at. I've definitely got that drive back more and I'm starting to do more skill based stuff. I've been practicing some tricking lately as well as just other movement general stuff. I'm doing a lot of skydiving lately and just exploring different things like rock climbing and so on. So I wanted to take this platform and I wanted to take this channel on that journey with me. Ultimately, it is going to be slightly less or a lot less training content and things like that. And more kind of journey based, more kind of hopefully informational based or informative like videos and messages and content that hopefully people can either relate to or actually find useful. So that might be financial driven, it might be industry driven. There's going to be a lot of different topics that I want to kind of cover uh, I mean, I'm moving into my mid-30s soon, still early 30s now, but I've learned a lot in 15 years, I would say solid, as a performer, as a brand builder, as a company owner, and really just learning a lot from those different kind of industries as well as the different roles that are played out, that I've played out and still continue to play out. And hopefully I can kind of offer some insight to you guys 
whether you are trying to become a performer, whether you're trying to become financially stable or financially free, maybe you're interested in investing in properties, which I've done a lot of, and I really just want to try and add value with content that people can actually find useful. So I don't want to make this video longer than it needs to be. This was more of an introduction video to kind of introduce where I'm at right now, what I've been doing, really try and spark the trend for the videos and the content that I'm going to start trying to bring to my channel. And hopefully, like I said, and I always live by this, if one person finds this stuff useful, then it's worth my time at the end of the day. I've definitely been in a position where I didn't have certain answers. I certainly don't have all the answers now. Um, but I'm definitely in a position where I have some answers, which I think might be able to add value to other people's lives in different ways, shapes or forms. And that's what I want to be able to do is to try and pass that on, because I really, truly believe a there's enough room at the top for everyone. I'm not necessarily anywhere near the top, but I would love to be a part of the journey that helps spark other people get to their top or their you know, goals and what they're trying to achieve in their targets in their life. And any ways that I can just kind of support and add value from the things that I have learned from the experiences that I've been able to experience. So with that said, this is really just a video to introduce what I'm starting to do where I've kind of been in the last couple of years, my move over to LA, my transition into now producing and managing and doing a lot of those things, my transition into being an investor of sorts in different areas, whether that's been through property or different businesses, and really just trying to kind of give you guys an idea of where I want to start taking my content, where I want to start taking my channel, and hopefully some of you want to join me on that journey. If not, that's totally cool. But those that do, stay tuned, hold tight, shit's coming.